Clay, congratulations. A 3-0 victory here at home to Morpeth Town. What are your overall thoughts on that one? Probably could have been more. Um, just the game got a little bit frustrating in, in, um, in like the middle third of the match, but I thought we started like an house on fire. We ended it strong. Three goals, clean sheet. This time of the season, you can't ask for much more, really. Obviously, you mentioned that that sort of um, period in the second half where the game sort of petered out a little bit. Um, just how well pleased were you with how well we managed that sort of period? Definitely, you know, what, what we want since we've come in is to be organised and structured without the ball because you're in the NPL. There's going to be times you come under pressure. We're not going to just be on at people for 90 minutes every game. It's You're going to have to withstand pressure at some point in games. I think we're coping with that. A little bit better. Um, so yeah, Morpa for a, a tricky customer really to deal with. Lynchy there, Gaffer's a, a top guy. He always has these teams playing the right way. But I think you could see, you know, first couple of minutes we're unlucky not get a couple of goals and probably could have been a few more for us. But I think yeah, like the middle, the middle third of the game, it just got a little bit boring. But I think you two nil up. They're trying to do all they can. They know how da dangerous we were in the spaces. So it was just a game of cat and mouse. And but like I said, the lads have managed it, and they deserve all the credit because they've bounced back from this time last week brilliantly. This week, I'm really proud of them. Obviously, the midfield three sort of Kane, Drummond, Kenji, and Luke Duffy, sort of an interchangeable sort of three. Obviously, Luke down the middle. What was your thought process behind, behind just, that? Just obviously, John's a massive miss. Um, obviously, Alex Curran would normally go in there, but he's injured, so. You know, Duff's wanted to do that role and thought he'd done it really well. Um, he got on all the set plays as well. We had a really well worked corner for for the second penalty, which which we'd worked on. And all credit to that, Lewis Arcastle works really hard on his set pieces. Um, fantastic young coach. Um, so that one was a good one for him. But yeah, um, Duff Duff's done all right in there today. Listen, it's going to always be be hard to to do what John Rooney and Alec Curran do. But we've we've scored three goals. We've got a clean sheet. We've got three points. It's it's a good day. And obviously another good day for a certain individual. Obviously Tunde getting a hat trick. Um, he's, he's a real asset to the side in that forward position. Hundred percent. Yeah. Listen, I, I go back years with Tunde um, when I was manager of Averton Coles and and us and Radcliffe were nip and tuck for the league. He's given me a few bad days in my time, Tunde. So I'm happy he's in my camp now. Um, great lad. Always wants to learn. Always wants to do well. He, he gives you everything he's got um, every single week and. Yeah, I was made up for Tunde today because obviously there's been a couple of games without a goal, but to get an hat-trick at home and obviously get took off with, what, 15, 18 minutes to go, he might have grabbed another. But I think at this at this time of the year when games are won, you need to be clever and tactical in your substitutions, make sure obviously people are on yellows and people who might be slightly not, not at 100%, you need to get them off the pitch as quick as you can and roll them out straight away for the next game. Obviously, next game is Tuesday night away to Ashton United. Yeah. Gone to Radcliffe and won today, so yeah. obviously it'll be another big test. But how much are you looking forward to to a challenge on what will be a, a, a difficult pitch? I'd imagine. Yeah, it's uh, it's going to be a tough game. They all are. Every every game at this league's tough, and I think it'll be it'll make for a real good game. I think Ashton are flying. We're doing really well. I think if we go toe to toe with each other, I think you know may the best team win, and and that's how I like my football to be played. So. I'm really looking forward to that one. Um, got great relationships at the club. I've, I've I've been there as a manager myself, and they'll not want to make it easy for us. But we're Macclesfield, aren't we? Everywhere we go, people want to make it that bit more difficult. And and I, and, but listen, Tuesday night we'll be looking for three points. Nothing, nothing more, nothing less.